The 25th installment on the Nutrition Playlist for Belvedere College Health and Wellbeing YouTube. This week we have Honey Chili Chicken with Oven Roasted Sweet Potato. You're going to serve about two to three people out of this, depending on how empty or full your belly is. We're going to start with preheating the oven to about 200 degrees and then we are going to chop up our sweet potato. This is kind of completely up to how thick or chunky you like your wedges we kind of just went for actual oven baked sweet potato with this separate to an actual wedge we just sliced them a big might i add it was quite a big sweet potato we sliced them four and then i just stabbed down just little air holes be very careful when you're doing that though because you don't want to cut the hand off yourself greased uh Grease the oven, oven bacon tray there with a little bit of olive oil and I'm going to add some more olive oil over this and then seasoning. Now I, I got this over and uh, it was actually given as a gift from Portugal but it's like a mixed spice mix. I think there's salt in there, paprika, some, some other mixed herbs. Really, really nice. That's just going over the top of all the spuds and then they're going to go into the oven for between 45 minutes to an hour. And you'll probably check them about halfway through now what is really good touch if you just drizzle a little bit of honey on all the spuds when you think they have about 10 minutes left you want them to be sort of crispy on the outside but soft on the inside when you get them out now into the bowl there Us is putting in our diced chicken fillets and what we're going to add to that is a decent portion of honey probably the equivalent of i'd say three tablespoons here and some sriracha sauce so we kind of just eyeballed but i would say it's a decent dollop of it you're probably talking about four to five tablespoons of sriracha sauce and the combination of the honey with the sriracha sauce just gives that lovely sort of spicy but not too spicy sticky chicken flavor you're gonna see it cooking away here on the pan Alan doing a fantastic job. So we kind of want that brown layer, the almost sugary layer to be coating around them. We've taken the sweet potato out. As you can see, soft on the inside, crispy on the outside. And we have garnished the chicken with sesame seeds and spring onion. Needless to say, this did not last long on the plate. An absolutely lovely dish. And it really is so simple to make. So give it a try. Take a snap, let us know how you get on and enjoy your grub.